Hello guys, welcome to this video and today we're going to learn how to change the color of any object in Adobe Premiere Pro. At the end of this video, we'll see how to apply cinematic LUTs to produce an epic video. Be sure to subscribe if you are new to this channel and turn on the notifications bell to get notified whenever we have a new upload. The first thing you have to do is open Adobe Premiere Pro and drag your footage to the timeline. Adjust the playback head to a good position to access your editing target. Thereafter, go to Window menu and click Workspaces, then select Color. On the Lumetri Color panel, select HSL Secondary. Here, H is Hue, S is Saturation, and L is Luminance, which means Lighting. Select the color picker and point to the color that you want to change. Click on the checkbox for color gray so that we can mask the selected object properly. Now, click the color picker and select more on your targeted color to cover the whole area. After that, make some adjustments to the selected color by using Hue, Saturation and Luminance. Move down to the Refine submenu and add a little blur to make the color smoother. Now, scroll down a little bit and select any color that you want your object to appear from the color wheel. Let's add a little bit of blue to get the yellow color. Now you can make further adjustments for temperature, tint, contrast, sharpness and saturation. And check the color gray box to preview the color change in your footage. And this is our before and after. Now we are done with the color changes. We need to apply the same color settings to the other footage. Right click on the edited footage and click copy. Right click on the other footage and click paste attributes. From the dialog, uncheck other attributes and check on Lumetri color only. Now, we have a uniform color change on both footages. Finally, we will apply a preset that will make our footage cinematic and epic. On the Lumetri color panel, click on basic corrections, go to LUTs and click browse to choose the directory of your preset. From here, we are done with making a cinematic video. Follow the previous steps to copy and paste attributes to the other footage. Let's see the preview. That's it for today guys. Thank you for watching this video and hope to see you in the next one. Be 100% creative.